Studio Plug. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Studio Plug and in this video I'll be showing you guys how to make a 6 9 type beat. If you don't know who he is then you guys are sleeping on him because he's blowing up pretty fast right now. Uh, just go ahead and type in 6 9 on YouTube or Takashi on uh, whatever. And uh, you guys will see most of his songs on YouTube or uh, SoundCloud or wherever you want to search him. And he has a couple of big collabs like with Trippy Red. But anyways, let's go ahead into the tutorial. So the first sound is dance piano and is under the keys expansion and the second sound is a pad it is a, a, a little ambient type of sound pad and it is called one magic pad mf all right let me play this yeah, piano sound forgot about that and then i got hi-hats a wooden perk a clap a, another clap I'm not going to use the band's clap, so I'm going to delete it. Open hat, a kick, and an 808. So when you open up FL Studio, it probably starts you off at 130 or 120. I'm just going to go ahead and pick it up to 150. And for this video, I will be using a MIDI. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, it's It wasn't planned. Um, sometimes I use a MIDI, sometimes I don't. Um, for this one, I use DJ Vibes Licks and Diamonds MIDI Kit, which is available at studioplug.net. And the MIDI is the 26. So I'm gonna go ahead and send it in and show you guys how it sounds and then we'll um, go from there, so. Okay, now we have it in that, now we have the melody in that channel. Let's go ahead and paste it onto the next channel. Let's see how it sounds. I'm gonna fill up some more open hatches to make it more jumpy. This kind of feels like more of a, like when D, you know, when YG came out and DJ Mustard and they all had that little West Coast type of feel. This is kind of how it feels like. Right, so let's go ahead and just add the kick now. Now we have the kick in there. I'm just gonna go ahead and bring up the velocity. And the volume is all the way up as well. Now let's go ahead and add the 808s. Now let's go ahead and add the 808s. All right, so the 808, we're just gonna have to mess with it and try to find where it's at. So let's go ahead and look for it. Also, if you guys notice how the bass is in the note, I'm, I'm doing it, uh, I'm just going from one note to the next note on top of it. So I'm going to show you guys quick. Uh, for this piano, I'm just going to add an extra melody, and it'll be like the bass. Uh, sorry, I'm on the wrong one. So on the piano, I'm going to look for the lowest note, and I'm just going to add a lower note right there as well. 
And then I'm going to go up one. So it gives it like that little, uh, uh, that little um, six nine feel. Now let's go ahead and uh, remove the uh, the muting and let's go back into the notes and push Alt L just to stretch them out. And let's go ahead and push Control Q just to quantize it. Make sure everything's fitting right and nothing's um, off beat. And then I'm going to hmm. I'm just going to go ahead and try on the clap and the open hat. And I'm just going to drop the uh, the octave on it. All right, so that's pretty much the beat right there. I'm just going to go ahead and do some quick mixing and then just lay it out on the playlist. So I have them highlighted. I'm just going to go ahead and push Control shift l And they are there now. And I'm going to go ahead and just quickly EQ them. All right, so now that we have them all slightly EQ'd, I'm just going to go ahead and bring all the volumes down on this, uh, this, whole, chan on this whole mixer channel. And then I'm just going to go into the piano and let's go ahead and start leveling out. So let's go ahead and bring the volumes up one by one. Now I'm going to go ahead into Maximus. I already have it here, but it's on default. So I'm just going to send it to Master 8 and then bring up the post. So 
now we have the clap and everything. So as you can see, this is just pretty much a piano, a pad. That's all the instruments, a hi-hat, per clap, open hat, kick, and an 808. Not much added. Remember, sometimes you don't need to add a lot. Sometimes you do. It is what it is. At, at the end of the day, it's just whatever you like to add, whatever you want to add. Uh, a lot of people are always like, less is more. A lot of people like to add more. Depends on the beat. You can never say less is more, but sometimes it is. <laughs> but let's go ahead and play it now. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and color it now. So this color selected. Let's go to gradient, and I'm just going to pick, like, purple and blue. I don't know. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and just split by channel. Now let's go ahead and highlight all of the no all the patterns and just drag them to track one. And now you have them there. And now let's just finish this beat. All right, before I finish, I'm just going to add one more 808, and it's going to be the 808 without a kick. And I'm going to go ahead and send it to 8, copy this one, paste it onto this one, copy the same volume, paste it onto this one. And I'm also going to go into the notes and paste the same note. I think it goes about right here between C3 and C4, or right here. And I'm just going to go ahead and mute this one. And then I'm going to go into the envelope and bring everything down besides the hold. See how it sounds now. <laughs> we got to throw it right here and then let's see how it sounds. Or let's go ahead and clone it first. So I'm just going to delete this. And then clone. And then delete it again and paste that one. And now we have the uh, 808 right here. Oh, wrong 808. <clears throat> Something's off. It's not on the note. Uh, I was messing with the wrong one. Anyways, that is it for this video. If you guys like what you guys saw, make sure to give it a like, comment, give me some feedback. Um, I would really appreciate that. Uh, 
I did really start this from scratch for you guys. Um, I just like to have the sounds pre um, pre selected that way I don't have to waste nobody's time. And I already have pretty much the beats ready as I am a beat producer as well. I'm not just a tutorial maker. So, but anyways, um, thank you guys for watching again. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and let the beat play now, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys for watching. Studio plug. plug. plug studio plug